looking at a beef ovana beef is a beef excess framework ovan uh, so there are certain things you need like uh, ng rock uh, but ng rock uh, doesn't support uh, multiple tunnels okay uh, if you want uh, multiple tunnels for free because i have a premium account over here so i am going to use ng rock but in case even if you don't have ng rock you can use uh, the servio it's similar to ng rock uh, the main things you need to change over here are the port numbers it shows triple eight and triple nine where you will have to change it to 80 and uh, to 3000 so that is what like uh, we are mainly looking at uh, when it comes to servio uh, i am not a very big fan of servio but still uh, it's up to you guys to how to work it out so it's quite easy if you just go through the documentation okay so i i hope you guys know the basic things like how to download uh, the git clone thing and the basic things so i'm not going uh, very much into basics okay so i already have uh, downloaded uh, the ng rock and other stuff so yeah so before you guys uh, work on certain things like if you just look over here uh, you need you guys need to download ng rock and you need to configure the yaml page of the ng rock like this please make sure you put your authentication token over here which you can get it from the ng rock uh, status section uh, over here the auth uh, but i'm not going to show you guys uh, since someone might misuse it uh, so uh, this is how like uh, and make sure the indentation is proper if the indentation is not proper uh, what happens is the um, uh, 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 the start all command doesn't work so make sure your uh, indentation is proper and also like I'm not going to uh, use my uh, domain as localhost uh, the, the reason why I'm not doing it is because obviously like people are much more scared when it when they see the URL to be uh, linked as uh, at the starting itself when they see like n876 something like that and dot ng rock dot io so people are scared about ng rock io so what i did was i just got a free domain name uh, from freenorm and uh, this is my domain name over here sign in dot linkedin dot com so obviously like uh, when i'm going to give the url to some person so obviously he's going to think the url is going to be a genuine one so that is the reason like uh, at the moment I, I have done it and once you have done that like you have something known as like you need to add a c name once you add your domain name over here and you just put a description it just creates a c name for you guys and you need to add the c name the dns management over here uh, for the particular domain you purchase from phenom okay so i hope like you guys have some idea so since like i already said i already have uh, the So let's so let me just python beef dot py and over here it's asking me hey boss like uh, okay uh, before doing this I need to do uh, what I need to do is uh, I need to start the ng rock command start minus minus all so here you can see my ng rock is starting and you can see like that my plan is pro so it allows me to run multiple session multiple tunneling sessions over the network so like you see over here they are saying as beef lessons on the port 3000 uh, so this link should be forward to 3000 and to send to victim you need to use the port 81 so please don't forget it uh, if you make a mistake it will not work okay let me just end that yep so you guys can see which one is port 80 and which one is not port 80 so this is the link and please do not add the HTTPS or the HTTP because this particular Python script gets confused so the link to be sent to the victim press enter to continue okay so it's starting the brief framework so let us give it some time 
it's it has started and again it's going to like ask me hey boss uh, can you please put me the url okay it's asking me for the url okay it won't work because the tunneling is activated so i'm just going to put the url which i need to give to the victim so this is the url i am going to give it to the victim and then the admin panel url you can see over here which is the 3000 it's directing from the port 3000 so this will be my url so yep so here it says hey boss you can just like uh, get into the beef so the username will be beef and the password will be beef as well quite easy to remember so let's go back and let me just see okay this is the url which i need to give to my victim in order to cook so let me just try my vm vision uh, where please bear with me uh, my machine is quite slow okay so let's paste and go uh, it's going to take quite some time so let's now get here and see whether it pops up uh, the browser should pop up over here saying someone got hooked up okay it says beef basic demo uh, you can edit this html page uh, even like uh, something cool because obviously uh, once the person uh, if he's going to be a cyber security guy or anything uh, who is a tech guy obviously he's going to be uh, not happy seeing the beef he would just fish him out so okay i can see uh, someone from my ip address okay i can see like he's using chrome 69.03 that's a recent version which we are using and we have browser plugins these are all like default plugins and i can see flash no vb script no phone gap no google gas no so if the uh, and i can also see his web rtc has been enabled okay that's something and you can see the url where he signed in the cookies the ip address operating system is windows and the cpu is a very tiny 64 bit operating system okay so the main thing i wanted to show you guys is I, I, uh, because like uh, most of the time you would have visited any website and you would be getting a pop-up saying hey boss let's install flash player if you need to view this video or uh, hey boss to view this website uh, you need to perform this particular uh, you need to install these plugins so uh, as a uh, as attack uh, what i would like to do now is okay so you need to stop and um, let me just sell us it and search console i already have a script uh, uh, it's just like a resource script um, so what it does is uh, i already have the commands uh, where it also has the uh, what do you say uh, all the commands like uh, how to generate the payload and then like uh, to start a handler so uh, it's not a big script but i can show you guys uh, if you haven't seen my previous uh, video like how uh, I use uh, MSF when, when you can do everything in Metasploit so this is how like I start my I, I generate my payload as well as my uh, uh, handler as well so uh, I, I don't need to do the MSF when, uh, and uh, do all the payload equal to blah 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 then hello and then again come over here to Meta and run Metasploit and then again I don't need to set the hello set L port uh, and then exploit minus j so th that's like a kind of long thing so instead we can do like this so this is how the commands look so i'm just like to i just want to create something like flash play update.exe so you guys can see like uh, okay something is wrong let me ls okay i can see somewhere Okay, let me just jobs minus k0 that and I'm not sure like why the generate command did it work generate minus t a x e blah blah okay let me just copy paste it and let's see 
it's a mistake over here okay I'm not sure like why Metasploit did this and now I'll just start a handler over here okay so I have a file which is known as like flashplay.eat so what I will do is I'll just upload it to SendSpace so okay let me upload it oh yes okay the download link let me click it so right click I just need a direct link so just right click okay this is what I wanted to show you guys an additional plugin is required to display some elements on this page so assuming like uh, this website has some video content and we can uh, give it a default thing for example like pirated movie kind of website and you can ask your friend or your uh, so it's all about your convincing abilities so once I click on install plugin so obviously it's going to send it me to oh my god uh, that's because the, uh, the website just got expired so for, because uh, the direct link doesn't work for long when it comes to send space there are other anonymous hostings which will help you out guys so terribly terribly sorry about it because it will directly download uh, the point I'm trying to make over here is uh, it will try to directly download uh, the file so that is a point over here uh, instead of like taking you to that particular website so you can see over here okay my google chrome is blocking it because i haven't uh, done any uh, assembly language or encryption kind of thing so what i'll do is i'll just leave it over here so it automatically it won't even uh, prompt you to save or anything so assuming like uh, once you keep the file it says the hey boss it's a flash player update uh, so once the person clicks on it uh, we should be able to get a session over there uh, where we already uh, did the handler and other stuff so over here uh, and if i am right do it since we are on the same network okay so we have sessions over here so minus i and you can do whatever you feel like uh, take session for keylog etc etc so uh, this is how you do it uh, how you do it in the van and uh, my favorite one is like a fake flash update uh, but however it won't work uh, the, the reason why I'm saying is uh, uh, because okay just give me a minute let me just uh, show it to you guys should be uh, it should be over here This is the image you are because so you just have to replace the image in order to uh, look at like a fake update. So if you just go here, you should get a thing like an update to Adobe Flash Player. So you just have to install it at the top 10 Facebook games, blah blah blah. So it all depends like how you can uh, now make your web and see and fall for it uh, so have fun guys and see you also bye bye